I'm Ben Buckner, Chief Grains Analyst with Ag Resource Company. In this video, we're going to talk a little bit about corn and domestic use. I think we've all thought that the story during the you know, post-harvest period would be about exports, but it turns out that it's domestic use, ethanol specifically, that's driving the market. Margins are incredibly profitable. We don't really have ethanol stocks to draw from anymore, and gasoline use is now consistently at pre-COVID level. So to us, whatever ethanol that we use in the gasoline blend now must be produced. And so the numbers on that are increasingly getting way above the USDA's forecast. So I think even the corn bears have started to dial in uh, additional demand of 150 to 250 million bushels. So everyone has been forced to cut their stocks forecast. And we don't think that this really changes for the next several months. You know, there's not going to be a lot of competition for ethanol exports from Brazil. And again, the U.S. has to match whatever gasoline use is for the next several months. So we think that the industry stays at something like 95 or 97 percent of capacity, which will increase or really sustain this active demand draw in the U.S. domestic corn marketplace. 